All right. I'm gonna give you all a brief tutorial on why gated communities suck and why you should never ever consider buying a house in a gated community. And here is why coming up very shortly. Okay, this woman knows who I am, and every time I come, she still asks who I am. Hello. How are you doing? I'm here to visit the ball residents. I'm on the permanent guest list for them. See what I mean, people? Put this someplace? Oh, you're killing me. Nah. Thank you. You have a good one. And they give you this stupid rear view mirror pass. Where where do you would you like me to put it on my bike? And the funny thing is, uh, if I drop this bike getting this. The funny thing is is that woman has let me through 20 times on the bike. She's let me through easily 20 times on the bike. And then one day I'm waiting to go through and she stops me and I just stare at her and I'm waiting for her to engage in conversation. And it's just this awkward silent stare for like 30 seconds and I'm like, Hi. She goes, hello, who are you here to see? I'm like, you let me in the gate three days ago on the same bike. And she's like, I can't see your face. I said, ma'am, you didn't see my face last time because usually they wave bikers in. But that lady knows me personally. I think old age has struck her. But yeah, they give you that stupid pass and it's like, where would you like me to put it on the bike? Because this is going to blow away and then I'm going to litter in your HOA friendly freaking neighborhood. I guess that's what you pay thousands of dollars a year for, a security desk. But look at these roads, how shitty they are. Your money's not going to that. Oh, I don't know guys, I don't know. But yeah, that's why gated communities suck, HOAs suck, and why you should never live in a gated community, because your guests are not gonna come visit you anymore because they're gonna get sick and tired of that shit. Because that seriously puts five, 10 minutes extra on your trip every time, stopping at that stupid gate. You understand they have a job to do, but when the same lady lets you in every single time and then abruptly she she says, who are you here to see? Like she doesn't know who the hell you are. That's just a little crazy, in my opinion. Anyway, that's enough ranting for the day. You all ride safe out there. And try to stay away from all the crazies, the crazy cagers. All right, Rick's out.